<sighs> and we are back again with more vlogging. Sorry that I was a little late this morning with publishing. I just ended up shooting too much on these fun lenses yesterday. So then I couldn't really stop editing. And then Michaela had to go to the hospital this morning. So that's kind of what threw our time schedule a bit off. Uh, she was sick when she flew over here. So I'm crossing my fingers that she is feeling better. So while I wait for more news from Michaela, I'm gonna go ahead and try to do a few more laps. As you know, I gotta do 25 laps a day and it takes a little while, but it's such perfect training to do it. So time for me to jump in here and crisscross underneath all the swans and start doing my laps. So glad I bought these Cyclops, they're really, much more fun to swim underwater when you can actually watch. But this swan just keeps being in the way the whole time. All right, see you in the I totally forgot to breathe because I was talking to the camera, so that was horrible. So you finished with your 25 laps? Yeah, I finished already. Good. So it's really nice. So you're early. I'm early, but for now, Chill mode. This is Miss Editor. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm concentrated. Okay, so I should leave you alone. When you get into it, it's just like <laughs> you go and crazy. Time flies. <laughs> I know. But Michaela is back now, at least, and she's doing okay. Yeah, but she was sick. Poor girl. Yeah. Well, sorry for her. I'm gonna go ask Riley see what he wants to do. Okay. Okay. Good Ciao. luck. You know what? I'm kind of sick of doing nothing. Me too. So I think I'm gonna take you up on that idea of yours to get weights and run on the bottom of the pool. Which which ones should we get? The big round? Heavier the better. Heavier the better? Let's go look. <laughs> yes, we're doing Wait, something. Oh, never mind. Kettlebells, perfect. Is that good? Yeah. Underwater they're a lot lighter. Man, these are really tired or heavy. I'm already tired. <laughs> I don't know if this was a good idea. We're gonna find out. Um, we do need to clear some swans though, so we have some space. Oh! This guy has a broken neck. He's dead. I need him in the cyclop. AKA Ow, doggers. it's really hot. Yeah. You're gonna sink like a stone with those things. That's the point. Okay. Are you, are you gonna drop them when you hit the bottom or are you gonna hold? I might just pass out. If you see me not moving, come get me, all right? All right. <laughs> okay, ready? I give this a 50% success rate. <laughs> That's pretty high. <laughs> okay, one, two, How was that? Oh, a lot more tiring than swimming. Oh yeah? Oh. See, as soon as I get to do things, I feel so much better again. We were a little lazy, a little tired and boring. Yeah, and then you don't feel good and then you don't do anything, but as soon as you do something, you feel good. Yeah. Well, fun? Yeah, it's great training. It's different than swimming. It's just the horrible sound it makes underwater, even if when you put your foot down real hard. Yeah. It's like, dink. Oh, that felt awesome to do something finally today. And what felt even better was that Richard just texted us and said that he's not using the Lambo in like half an hour. So me and Riley are gonna go drive a Lambo. So what do you think? It looks way better in person. I want everyone to know that. I think we should go drive it. Look what Richard gave me. Oh. Oh. Let's do it. Yeah, I love this song. 7% discount, is that still on the table? It's nice, it's nice, it's nice, it's nice. All right, let's go.
do you feel? I feel pretty at home, to tell you the truth. I'm gonna get in and we'll see how it feels on the road. Let's go. Come on in. I almost forgot how small it is in here. It is pretty tight. I just want to hear it. I want to hear it really, uh, where are we going? Straight? Uh, yeah. So, I know you've driven pretty much every Lambo and sports car there is, but have you driven this before? This is the main one I've wanted to drive for a long time. I've driven tons of other supercars, but this thing just feels so raw and so good. Love it. I mean, listen to that, come on. I think I should get out and film this thing from the outside so everyone on YouTube can see what it looks like from the outside instead of just from the inside. I think we should do that. We need to find good turnaround spots though. The Ronda Road and it is physically impossible to turn around anywhere here. Just turn around. So basically what happened was that we went on this road and there was zero places to turn around. Everything looks like this. Not Lambo friendly. And we wanted to shoot the car, but that doesn't work when you can't turn around. Do you want to explain why we're sucking so hard right now? Well, Yoon brought us to this road that was supposed to be very good for turning around and filming on. We've been driving for 45 minutes. We found two places to turn around at that were not off-road material. And we ended up turning around on this fairly shitty turnaround spot. This sucks. Like, I just... Sucks! Damn it! Uh, uh, oh, we're good. No scrapes! Come on, Spain! Woo! That is better! have some pull in this thing. This guy's kind of getting after the man. Yeah. I got respect for the Fiat. So, so far, what do you think of the car? It sounds so damn good. It's a little tight and there's a lot of traffic here, but I think um, it's just freaking me out because it's rear wheel drive. And I love that because I've had to drift these and it never works out well. And now I know that this is actually driftable, but we're on some tight little road. <laughs> Drift it, drift it, drift it! I'm really steady. Hello house! We're finally back after our successful... If you want to call it that. No, film-wise not successful, fun-wise. Successful. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and say that this is kind of the only shot we got today. Yeah. Because it looks real cool with the car here, in front of the house. But driving wise, that was the worst road I've ever tried to get a, a piece of video on a car ever. That was an absolute fail on the road <laughs> part. I hate when things don't go according to plan. Trial and error though. Now we know that that road sucks. Yeah, I will never ever try to film on that road again. It's like better to film a video in the driveway than that road. Was it nice? No. Well, it, it was nice driving, but everything else has gone wrong. And now, I'm looking at the rear here, and there's something missing. Do you see what's missing? That thing you're supposed to have on the back yeah. to like be a allowed. Number plate. A number plate. That's good to have. So it's just one of those days where Nothing works out. And now your eyes are red. Yeah. As you saw, that day didn't really turn out the way we planned it. And after we realized the plate was gone, I 
couldn't just sit here, so I jumped in the car, drove 45 minutes, and then went 10 kilometers an hour going up the road looking on the side to see if I could see the number plate. And I went up and down until it got dark, and um, that's why my eyes are red, but no number plates, so now it's going to be a hassle finding a new one. So this is, today has kind of not really worked out the way we wanted it to. So um, kind of the time I expected to edit this vlog went to searching number plate. So this is more like a rough cut today. I hope that we'll do for today. We have Marcus coming uh, <laughs> tomorrow. tomorrow, which is going to be awesome. Yeah. So uh, with that said, I'm going to go to bed because I really uh, need to finish this um, in the morning because I am completely dead after searching for that number plate. But I'm sure they will like the video anyway. Yeah, well, we got a couple shots, even though nothing, if you would have been with us, like I was really like not, not liking life whatsoever, because things didn't work out. Tomorrow's a new day. Tomorrow's a new day. Yay. That's why we need to go to bed so that we wake up refreshed and have a good day. I can feel it. Is, yeah. it. is it gonna be a good day? Tomorrow's gonna be an epic day. Let's do it. Yeah, good See night See you then. tomorrow. Good night, good night. Good night. Did I say good night? I think so. <laughs> okay, good, good night.